So if you've happened to purchase the Sapphire Pulse RX 5600 XT here, you can update the video BIOS to get increased performance on the card. And I'm going to give you a quick rundown of how that's done. First, you'll need to check to see if your card is applicable for the following video BIOS update, as later manufactured cards will not have to deal with this update in the future. To find this out, you'll need to check the part numbers which can be found on the side of the box or on the side of the graphics card. Make sure to double check that your card matches the part numbers listed below. If your card happens to match with the listed part numbers, you can apply the BIOS update to your card. Simply head over to the Sapphire website and go to the Sapphire Pulse RX 5600 XT product page. There you can find a link for the video BIOS download. Once downloaded, extract the files. And first, you must install the AMD VB Flash 3.04. Once that's done, turn off your computer and then switch the dual BIOS switch to the left hand side of the card. Once you've done that, reboot your machine and go into the folder with the BIOS update. Here you'll see a file called BIOS update swleft.bat. Once the bat file has been run, a command window will open up and close very, very quickly. Don't be surprised if you don't see it. I didn't see it the first time I ran this BIOS update. Your next step is to turn off the machine again and then switch the dual BIOS switch back to the right hand side again. Reboot the machine and then go back into the BIOS update folder and run the BIOS update swwrite.bat. And once that's done, simply restart your machine and then go enjoy some gaming.